Hello everyone, welcome back to a new vlog. My room is a little bit messy because I'm packing up for actually a really bucket list staycation location tonight um, here in New York. Me and Kellen are staying somewhere that's been on my list since I moved to this city and then we're also doing a shoot today so we're kind of tying it all in together so it's going to be a busy one but also a fun one I think so I'm going to bring you along with me I'll definitely vlog like all today and I might vlog a bit of the morning and then we're going to the Hamptons tomorrow evening so I'll see I'll see how this day goes and it'll either be a one day vlog or a couple days we'll see how we're getting on um I cannot believe it's November I'm actually so excited though i love this month so i want to do some more vlogs this month and then we're into december oh it's just the best time of the year and i actually have a question when is everyone putting up their trees because i'm ready i'm ready to put up the tree today is november 2nd yeah yesterday was the first so november 2nd like are we is next week too early and the reason i'm asking is because i have a trip coming up in the middle of the month and then we're into Thanksgiving when we come back straight away. So it's either put the tree up before the trip or wait until after Thanksgiving. And then we're going home to Ireland for Christmas, like the middle of December. So we'd only have two or three weeks with the tree, you know, if we wait till the end of November. So yeah, it's just this is inner thoughts in my head right now, basically. But let me know what you're doing and if next week is acceptable to put the tree up basically but anyway i'm in the middle of packing joey is here he's actually not coming with us and i feel like he knows like whenever he sees a suitcase or anything he kind of gets a bit anxious but tell me to be home to to mind him later on um so i'm packing up and i'm going to bring you with us for the day oh and actually while i have um five minutes these coats just arrived last night they're from this brand called overland and I really, this this year, I'm just really, really focused on getting my coat game perfect. I feel like I kind of worked on boots over the last couple of years and I have really good knitwear, but my coats, I think, are still lacking a little bit. So I spotted these three on Overland on their website and I figured I'd order them, try them out in person and then decide which I think is the best for my wardrobe. So this stunning green one, um, this is like kind of like an off-white cream. Oh, it's so soft quality like first impressions already amazing and then this one's really cool it looks kind of black on camera but it's actually brown and it's reversible so it's more of like a true brown on the inside and then more of a darker brown on the outside and this one's a bit longer so I think I'll try them on for you while I have a bit of time to spare now before we leave and decide which one I'm going to keep okay so let's do a little bit of a try on First we'll do this green one. I feel like the fit of this one is gonna be really good. This one feels really nice on. Let me do a bit of a turn. Obviously this is gonna be like more of a shorter jacket. This is kind of perfect for this time of the year now, autumn into winter, but it's really warm. I think even like in the very cold months, if I was properly bundled up inside, this would actually be like super warm and like I could walk around no problem in New York. So yeah, let me know what you think about this one. Very nice details, very nice fit, and feels warm. And next is this beauty. I think first impressions, this is probably my favorite so far, but we'll see how it looks on. Oh yeah, this feels lovely. It has three quarter length sleeves, which I actually love because you can wear something inside then or if you had a leather glove or just a nice detail. And then obviously with this one, you can leave it open or you could close it off. But that's kind of what it would be like closed off. And it has pockets. This is how it looks at the back. Gorgeous, but like all black. Or this would also be stunning with an all cream outfit, like wide leg cream trousers, a simple cream top. Oh, this feels really luxurious. Last but not least, this one. Brown is probably my favorite color this season. I'm sure you're all seeing it everywhere as well like a chocolate brown and I think in this style of coat oh so luxurious like this feels really nice and as I said it's reversible I'll show you a a clip of a full length of the coat because it is quite long so you can see how long it goes down on me I'm 5'4 for reference and then I'll show you the reverse as well it's really beautiful feels comfortable again it has pockets it has buttons that you can tie so you could do this like fully closed or you could keep it more open with a nice look inside 
This is gorgeous too. Oh, I don't know which is my favorite. <laughs> I feel like I like them all for different reasons. They definitely are investment pieces and that's what I'm really focusing on this autumn winter. Like I want to buy coats this winter that I'm going to have forever. I think in the past, you know, I've bought cheaper coats that were more trendy and then it comes to a couple of years later and they're just, they don't feel like a good quality coat that you want to keep forever or they start to kind of you know the quality goes and stuff but with coats like this you will literally have them forever so i want to make sure i'm making the right decision so let me know in the comments which is your favorite and i'll also link them down below too hello from the plaza we're literally shook okay. like, it yeah, is maybe. so beautiful let me show you around okay so um they actually upgraded us to i think it's the deluxe king he said so you walk in and guys, look at the bed. I'm sorry, and the chandelier. Oh my God, like I'm blown away. I knew it was gonna be amazing, but it's honestly even more amazing than I expected. Look at the bathroom, let me turn on that chandelier. Oh wow, Kellen with the light on, it's even better. Green. Yeah, the bath, beautiful sink. This is an absolute dream. And then you can see the park. Let me show you. Oh, and I cannot wait to wear these. I think we're going to do a room service later on after we finish the shoot. Um, and look at this Central Park right there. I cannot believe we're here. I've literally wanted to stay here forever. And it's going to be so perfect for our shoot now. We're going to go downstairs now and get some food get some coffee and then do our shoot and then we can relax then after that. Oh, so cool. Pretty late, but we have finally <laughs> finished our shoot. Here's a little sneak peek of one of the looks. That was a long, long day and a long shoot. Um, I think we got some really good shots and just good everything. Um, yeah, keep an eye on my Instagram soon for all these pictures. And now we have just ordered room service. We're gonna go into this bed. We ordered spaghetti, pizza, all the good stuff. And we're gonna enjoy our night at the plaza. Okay, life absolutely made. Room service is here. We're definitely gonna have it in bed. We got spaghetti. Oh, that looks good. oh my God, I'm absolutely knocking face down. And we got margarita Yum. pizza oh my god this is literally heaven room service in the plaza life doesn't get better than this Good morning we are eating again say hi Kim. oh my god guys an omelet croissants kelly got those onion tile cakes so good okay it's the next day. Definitely don't look as glam today. My business are back in. We're just about to check out. We're really, really procrastinating it. This was amazing. Like if you get the chance ever to come and treat yourself to a night here, do, do it. it. Like I wish I did this sooner. Like while I've been here. I know. Nine years now. It's always been on my bucket list. It was amazing. Just everything and like the view. Let me show you this view again. Like this is how we woke up to this morning like unbelievable that's Gapstow bridge there you know that really famous bridge like the amount of times i've stood there and looked up at the plaza oh, it's amazing i think this time of the year is so nice too because all the leaves so i think autumn is a good time to stay here anyway we are packed up we got our bags I go home to my son. 
We got our shoot done. We had a very chill night. We got room service, had breakfast this morning. We were really sure we had breakfast for like two hours this morning. <laughs> it was so nice. Um, and yeah, that's a wrap. So we're going home now. Ken's gonna get Joey and then we're actually heading away again this evening. So we gotta do a turnaround and do lots of editing in between. Okay, it is now actually the next week um we had such a fab stay um i launched my jewelry collection it's all gone so well i'm wearing the all your earrings and i also have um the grace bracelet on so very exciting i wanted to vlog this little part of the the week because basically my mom is about to arrive my family and it is her 60th birthday this weekend so we are literally about to have a full week of celebrations we have so many things planned and then yeah, there's just a lot planned, but tonight's they just arrived, so Kellen's gone to get them and I've set up the apartment. Like a little surprise for her just for like the first arrival night and then we're gonna go for dinner. So let me just show you how everything looks. There is Mr. Joey, he got a haircut, so cute. Okay, so we have these 60 balloons and then we're gonna have a little champagne station over here bottle them away and then we have some gifts for her to open tonight we're kind of spacing out her gifts and then we actually also have the tree up i haven't decorated it yet but i wanted to get that up before um all this and then we have 16 ever looks so good take a little picture there soon and then i've just set up some sweet stuff because we're going for dinner so it's just small snacks and we're going to have a little pizza here um just to keep them going because they literally just flew in today and then we have drinks boys are hiding in the kitchen while I'm vlogging so yeah it's so exciting we're gonna have just such a great week I know it and I think she's gonna love everything that we've planned for her and all the things coming up so I wanted to just finish off this vlog showing you this and yeah I'm very excited so when I am not gonna vlog the trip because I kind of just want to be there and you know spend time and make sure everything she's having the best time make sure everything's going okay but I'll definitely vlog after this is all over and start showing you Christmas in New York. Maybe I'll do some sort of Vlogmas, we'll see. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to see some version of it or even just one or two vlogs throughout December just to show you all the Christmassy stuff and I'll be having our annual Christmas party. So lots of good things coming. But anyway, I just wanted to finish the vlog here. I hope you all have a good week and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.